Well, a very passionate Pacers fan is getting national attention tonight after, well, call it her cameo in ESPN's new documentary series called The Last Dance featuring, of course, MJ. Well, Kathy Barton Harrison is part of the Ed Martin car dealer family, but tonight at 6, our own Cameron Raider explains why so many are now referring to her by a brand new name, the name of Karen the Pacer fan. It was supposed to be all about Michael Jordan, but everyone's talking about the Pacer superfan who seemed to steal the spotlight. Kathy Martin Harrison was watching part nine of the 10 part documentary, The Last Dance, Sunday night with her husband. And the next thing I know, oh my goodness, there I am, bigger than life. I'm like, oh, oh my gosh. And um, I was just blown away. I watched these carefully a little bit. Lip reading's not even an art with you on this. You know, you know that? Yeah. <laughs> do you remember what you were saying? I do. I do. Pent up frustration, you know? That has made her a social media sensation, some referring to her as Karen the Pacer fan. My brother, he, this morning, he uh, texted me and said, you're bigger than um, Joe Exotic uh, right now. Your meme is bigger than Joe Exotic. I'm like, no way. So anyway, 22 years later, my husband said, I can run, but I can't hide. You are out of your seat. And that's probably why the camera found it, right? Yeah, it's really interesting. And I totally forgot about this. Um, a cameraman that was there, a national cameraman, because we were in the Eastern Conference Finals, came up and he said, hey, would you guys all sign these releases? Um, because if there's ever a Michael Jordan movie in the future, um, we would need you to be you know, released. I'm like, okay, whatever. So we, we signed them, but we had no idea. You know, we never heard another word. So, and then last night, bam. Kathy said her father, Ed Martin, a car dealer, bought tickets behind the Pacer bench 44 years ago, dating all the way back to the ABA days. And the family still has them. We just became very feisty fans. And uh, back then, a fan could be a fan. You know, we were allowed to banter with the bench. Go figure, huh? 20, over 20 years later, can you believe that? No, I, I, I'm in total shock. We took it ser seriously, but it was so much fun. Oh, that's so awesome. Now we just have to get all these sports teams back in action. Don't you guys agree?